Hello everyone, this is Serious Trivia. Welcome back to another episode of our Legendary Reboot Campaign. This is episode 18. We pick it up from turn 69 in the spring season of 208. So just jumping back into the game, uh, we are making pushes all around our empire. Uh, there was this slight mishap last turn where we weren't able to take down the Iron Mine and we let them slip back into the defensive position while we are pretty injured. So that's not good, but we can't really do much about it. Um, one option obviously is to retreat back, put Zhou Tai in here and, you know, get the easy delegate win, but I think we're just going to tough it out and we're going to try to win this fight the hard way. Uh, it's, it's a close defeat, that's interesting. Um, they have very healthy generals and we don't, which is a big issue, especially with Huang Zhong here. And they have towers and this is an iron mine, so that's another issue. Um, I feel like they're probably confident enough to charge out. Mm, so we'll see. Let's just jump in here and see if we can get a win here. Alrighty. At least it's not rainy. Um, let's see. How do we win this? I'm going to assume that they will charge out. And if they will charge out, I'll create this angle here where they have to funnel through this area so that we have the most opportunity to kind of shoot at them. And there's a little bump in the terrain here that could help us get some extra shot off perhaps. And we don't have to guard one side because cut the edge of the map technically. Um, so we can do something like this. Yeah, we lost parts of our siege weapons in the last fight as well. So that's tough. Um, melee evasion. We don't have to lose range block trance. If we go into square. Or we can have them tank up the archer damage. Like right here maybe. Hold on. Yeah, something like that. Hide him here. Can probably move them back a bit. Yeah, like that. Um, if they're going to try to flank us. I mean, honestly, we should just do this. Uh, a little bit this way. Alright, and the rest will block here. Oh, wait, uh, I didn't select the deployables. This one right here, and this right here. Alright, now we're just praying they come out. Uh, they're sitting still, but it's okay. We can kind of manually destroy the towers from here as well. Maybe that will convince them to come out? They might not. But we're getting free shots on the units. So I'm okay with that. Oh, they're not firing. Can we hit that? No. Is the angle messed up? Why can't we hit that? Oh, okay. They're firing. Good. That's on fire. That's not. There we go. Let's take this out too. Yeah, I don't know how we're going to win this. Alright, that's on fire. I'm going to take down all the towers first, and then we'll figure something out. We might move our siege weapon a little closer. Oh, that missed. Oh no, it's on fire. Good. I thought it missed. Okay, stop firing. Stop firing. 
Gonna put them out here to absorb enemy arrow damage. I think it's just a crossbowman. Two crossbowmen. Yeah, let's absorb their damage first. And then we can relocate our siege weapons a little bit. Call these two. Maybe just get a little bit more angle on the units. Alright, they're shooting at us. Please do. Alright, gonna manual fire for a little bit. Yeah, we can't hit these on the cliff because of the angle. Well, actually, we can hit this group. That's not really a hit. Alright, they can hit at most angles. I don't like how I don't like how the AI can just dodge these. Alright, let's just fire well. Yeah, we need to do a lot of work if we want to win. Four more volleys. Let them finish up. Wow, they're fire will and they can't hit anything? They just stop firing? No way. Fire? No target? Really? What if we go here? They're starting to shoot. These guys could probably win if we just choke off both doors and just fight at the door. But I want to use my siege weapons. Alright, they're in position. Fire well. And they're not firing. But there's clearly targets. Yeah, like that's targets. Okay, they're firing, but they're not, which is really weird. What if we move them even up? All right, they're done with all their ammo. Throw your traps here. Can you guys hit something now? Good, they're firing. Let's kill him. Charge. Oh, they got another crossbow unit in the back. Sneaky. Alright, we killed him. Block that door. Alright, 
All right, we'll pound this side. No, something like this would be better. Charge at us, please. Oh, they charged. Okay. Ooh. He used his ability. That's why the cooldown keeps going up. He's sealing our ability. Okay. Block that. Go here. Alright, I think we got this. They'll run out to die. Alright, pull back. Pull back. Try to kill that. Alright, we'll charge out. And then charge them from behind. Alright, we're good. Go kill that. Mm. Alright, they're routing. I think we win. There we go. Alright. Nobel's faction is no more, finally. Alrighty. Uh, Wang Shu. Let's see. We don't need him. Release. He's probably coming back to us through the pool because of the release. And we'll just occupy. Local hero. Okay, got a random general. Nobel's faction is destroyed. Soon you leveled up. Uh, do we need... I don't think he needs reach. Just because Dan Wei has it. We'll get patience for capture rate. Ooh, where's in the river? Mm, capture rate first. Who's the random general we got? Uh, Gong Chou Kai, a uh, random guy. Lots of, lots of like purple traits, expertise traits for a champion. We don't technically need him, so say goodbye. We run a very tight ship with mostly legendary characters, so off he goes. Uh, do we actually need to stay in this region? Seems like we're not at war with most of them. And it's actually quite hard for them to walk this way. I'm thinking about recalling them and then summoning them somewhere else. They could be trying to come through the path against our weapon craftsmen. It's a very attractive target for AI as well. Yeah, I think we're going to recall them. And we'll just resummon them. We might reorganize this army. Just because Dan Wei and Xun doesn't get along anymore. Maybe Xun will get along with these two. You never know. Alright, this will be a quick delegate win. To end Huang Zhu's faction as well. Now that he's vast. Ooh! Seriously? Why? Is it because we all this cavalry we have versus? That doesn't make sense. Yeah, but I'm too lazy to actually fight this one. We'll just delegate the win. Take the high casualty. Wow, seriously high casualty. Camp crushers have such bad delegate value. I'm surprised. Really surprised. Occupy. All right, Huangzhou's faction is done. Alright, zeal to make 
Zhang Liao actually strong. And yeah, we'll we'll let them rest up here. We're fine with the little turbans. Zhou Tai is holding on to this by himself. Um, I don't know if he can actually delegate a win against this whole army, but if he can, that would be pretty insane. I don't want to risk him getting captured and dying, though. That's the thing. I kind of want to experiment. But that's too insane. If we just fight him by himself and de delegate for a win. We'll see. We'll, we'll, we'll test it out. If not, we can always retreat. Um, this one's kind of attractive since we do have the level 3 labor building right now. So you can get minus 1 construction time. Um, tier 3 forges are also very attractive. But then we need this one first. We need to build a school. Level 4 inns are very good. Maybe this first. Alright, let's test it out. Okay, at least we can't delegate a win here. That's it's a valid defeat though. It's pretty insane. Uh, we're gonna withdraw. Um we're probably just gonna recall him. I don't want him to die. Or we can just pull him back. Uh eh, gonna recall him. So what's going to happen is we're probably going to lose the armor craftsman and we're going to have to recapture it. It's a little bit of a hassle, but we're okay with it. Wow, they didn't build they didn't build this up at all. All right, we don't want this. This is going to be a commerce place, very heavy commerce. Okay, we're going to leave that alone for now. We have a few other army to attend to. All the way in the north, we're in an awkward situation where we want to destroy this army, but we can't reach it. I guess we just go here. And chase him down next turn. And take down the city as well, give it to the High Empire. And then maybe destroy Zhangyang once and for all. Alright, they're just going to hover. There's nothing for this army to do. We just got to keep an eye on Sun Tzu's territory to see when he recruits a new army. We can't see here, but I think if I were him or the AI, I would summon it in the city. That's my guess, at least. Alright, we continue to take land. Hmm. I'm going to fight this and cut it out just because there's a big army nearby. So see you guys at the end. Alrighty, easy win. So, yeah, we'll just defend them if they want to attack us in the fishing port. It's not a bad place. Although, I kind of want to fight in the field with our siege weapons. So if they want to come, we'll just fight outside. Um, that's most of our armies. This one's just spying. We should play summon Lu Bu somewhere. We need him to keep fighting so we can keep maintaining our momentum. Um, let's see. Who's on our list that we can actually fight? Sun Tzu's faction doesn't have any armies on the field. It's a little bit sad. We could summon Lu Bu here and just retake our farmland and then just go north and just tear people down for fun. No one's on the list that's out right now. Gongsun Zan doesn't have an army. Yeah, maybe that's the way to go here. We can send him out. Recall. Charge out. Oh my god, this one man wrecking crew. Unleashed. And let's see. Right. Lots of construction project here. So we do have tons of money. So we're going to build this. We're going to build this. We got this built. We got this built. 
I guess we keep it and we just go with this instead of um, private workshop. Private workshop's better, but with the population situation and without administrator, this is keeping our population growing, which is probably the way we want it to go. Let's see, anything else? Hmm. We can get rid of the temple. We can rush it. And instead, we need to build the labor building here. Yeah, it makes more sense here because there's no commerce. So maybe we need to put Dianwei in Badong instead. Hmm, we'll see. Not a pressing issue. Why is it negative again? Why are you losing reserve again? Who's using up the reserve? Wait, is Liu Bei using up the reserve in the city here? Does he have no... He has no food. No, he has food. That's not the problem. Hmm. That is weird. Here, his, hap his happiness with us is going down a little bit. Um, take the lumber yard. Anything else we can ask of him? I mean, we could annex him any time. Yeah, it's fine. We'll just keep him happy for now. We'll keep Don't Lie to give to him in the future as well. The High Empire can have most of the North. Sun Tzu wants peace now. I mean, I don't mind. Ah, uh, doesn't want to be our vassal. That's the thing. Yeah, that's not going to happen, my friend. Summon the army so I can actually fight you. Yeah, nothing is really happening. <laughs> we want Liu Xie. Oh, I could use another spy in his faction now that he's back at war with us. Mm, we have a spy in his faction. Alright, we're good, I think. We could use a spy in Tal Tal's faction, but I like to keep an empty slot as well. Yeah, no one very, no one interesting here at all. She's in the army though, so that's nice. All right, we can end turn. Let's go. Oh, Dryan killed our spy. Interesting. All right, Jotai got the solidarity event. Wanted to check if he was a bandit or not. He's not, so we're not interested. Oh, our spy in Ma Teng's faction is already... Alright, we have some rebellions. It's okay. We got armies right next to it. Good night. Good night. Who leveled up? Okay, Huang Zhu's wife. Alright, now she can do the industrial exploitation boost. Can we catch up to that army? Wait, where did they go? Oh, no, 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 no. He went this way. Wait, Yuan Shao's back on the field. 
we will march. How did he slip by us? He was here. He just ran all the way over here. Uh, Gongsun, just come out, you know? Don't make us hard on us. We didn't. They're sieging it. What a weird choice. Alright, we'll show up. Delegate? Can't win the delegate. Oh, not even reinforcing. That's weird. Okay, hold on. Um, they're not in range? Now they should be. Ah, see, they leave. Good. Let's fix this up. They ran. Alright, let's just fight this one. Um, okay, none of the general have items. That's good. They just have a lot of men. We should be able to beat this, no problem. Alrighty, um, let's see how do we want to fight this. We probably just want to stay right here on the farmland. Let them run towards us. Uh, Ma Chao play go out there, take down the Onyx Dragons before they touch us. We'll put her here with the bow. Stretched out. Well, that little house is interesting. Okay. Yeah, we're burning down people's farm again. Alright, they're here to soak up enemy archers. Mm, probably hide them. Actually, they have guerrilla deployment. Hide them here. Mm, stand in the back for now. Yeah, that's good. Let's go. They got so much range. I oh, wish we'll wait a little bit. We should wait till they get into our firing range. Which is very soon. Alright, pop out. Uh, not dueling yet. Need to finish the mission of destroying the range units. Nice. That's a great shot. Right on the Onyx Dragons. Uh, why not roar, right? Let's charge at the crossbow. Fury of Beihai as well. We'll charge at the ones that's getting closer. Mm, we'll have to let those archers get close. Nothing we can do about that. Oh, enemy cavalry charging at us. Time to get out. Uh, decline as well. Alright, let's charge out. Actually, you know, hold. Don't want to get shot up by them. Let's call them two. 
stop these guys. Oh, Jamma Jian. That's deceiving. Anti cav as well. Alright, they're not braced. Roar. Oh, they almost found us. But they didn't. Go take them down. Alright, kill that first. Stay on that, stay on that. We'll take those base damage. We have armor. Oh, we don't need them to be standing here, actually. Alright, they can actually charge out. Go after that. Ooh, they're actually shooting at our cavalry. Uh, not an easy place for us to charge into that with all these spear guards. And I don't really want to leave them alone. Alright, we'll take her off our hand. Debuff. Alright, pour out. Crush these range units. Into that. Into that. Into that. We'll get that one. Alright, she should win, no problem. Come to this side. Alright, this should speed up how fast we crush the range units. Alright, go attack that. Anyone to reverse charge? Not yet, I guess. Actually, you take care of that. You take care of this. I think they're all routing. Duel's not over? Oh, just in time. And that's the win. Not bad. Alrighty. That ends Coral's last giant army. We're not getting the displays for the extra fame and fortune, but it's still going up and still ongoing, which is interesting. Um, I don't know if they'll actually pay us anything, but it doesn't matter. We're going to end Coral's faction. That's, that's the desire here. We'll keep the farmland. We'll keep the food production. All right, they moved. Lubu. Our one man wrecking crew. Oh, they ran. Wait, where did the, this army go? Oh, Zhang Fei and them probably fought them. Well, I don't actually want Liu Bei to have this piece of land. It's better if we take it. Heroic victory, delegate. It's ridiculous. Do we even lose health? Oh, we lost a big chunk of our health. Okay, that's fair. Uh, occupy. Wait, why do we have a contract on Zhang Yan? I thought... Wait, what? We have a contract on Zhang Yan? No way. That is messed up. I know we didn't get in a contract with them. But I'll take the thousand gold. I I don't mind it. And I guess we fight more of them. Or, I mean, Lu Bu's gonna keep crossing. We should hunt down this spy army too. Mm, what should we do with her? 
we could just revolt, right? Take the control of the army and then delete her from the field. That will force him to have just one army and then maybe he'll summon himself. Let's just do that. Success. Now we... Move you. We can't move you? No movement? Ah, guess we won't delete her Renu then. She's just gonna go. She's the wife! Oh, they have so many kids together. Should we keep her until this kids come of age? Okay, we'll keep her. We'll keep her. We'll get rid of her retinue, summon her back, and just let her be a Simon character. Cool. That works out. Alright, Rebellion imminent. We're going to have to summon those three generals back again. Going to need rebel farmers here for a while. Okay, they're good. Yeah, we just got new land, so they're going to be pretty angry for us for a little bit. Alright, going to build that up. Rebel has spawned here. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know about that. I kind of wanted to summon the army. They're going to go down this way. We're not at war with any of these factions. We are at war with them. But they're not summoning any more armies, which is really annoying. Um, this army is going to be freed up to sail north. So I don't think we need any help on the north and front. We might actually summon an army here and make them cross this terrible terrain to go into Ma Teng's land. Yeah, let's do that. First, I want to see if he's willing to become our vassal or something. No, he's not. Okay. Damn, wait. Oh, we ran out of deployments. Okay, we might want to build a conscription building somewhere to give us a little bit of extra deployment. Right, that's fine. He can muster for now. We have to find them a strategist as well. Okay, I think we're good. Um, we'll look at a few other spying options. Maybe someone against Tal Tal to maybe steal a territory from him if he's like a administrator. Deploy. We'll take an extra turn code against them. He doesn't have a job. Great. What a useless person you are. Did Tothal get anyone interesting? He took in Dashu, but yeah, no one interesting. And he's in court doing nothing. Which is pretty bad. Alright, we'll get some undercover network. Plus 12. Okay, that's good to know. Okay, so we control him. He's a general, and we also control her, also a general. Two different generals in two different commanderies. We'll just rack up points for now. And then we'll set up an offensive force against him as well. Okay, that's pretty good. Let's continue. Alright, and the yellow turban, the rebels are attacking the temple, which means they're just suiciding, which is fine. All right, they got wiped. All right, Tal Tal instigated a proxy war between the other two kingdoms. Good job, Tal Tal, good job. Now the three kingdoms are in a triangle. And then something else interesting happened. 
Okay, they're just declaring war on other factions. That's fine. Samai is on the field. He's probably going to leave Tal Tal, even though Tal Tal is pretty strong. I'm not sure if Tal Tal can keep him happy. Oh, he became a general. Good for him. Suryan got married off into Liu Yao's faction. I'm a little disappointed in Sun Tzu. I mean, we were in-laws, right? So we, we were relatives, so there's no way we could have married her. But now I'm just, I don't know. I'm just a little disappointed that he made that decision. Which means we should just go to war with Liu Yao almost like immediately to take care of that situation. Although she won't die. She's young. All right, this army's here. We just want to wipe them out. I'm okay with this result because we're switching. Or release. Okay, so what we plan to do here is we plan to make a swap. Xun Yu. Uh, Xun Yu only gets along with Guo Tu. That's not good. Hmm. So there's no ideal strategist here. Maybe Guo Tu will just stay then. I guess we won't swap. We'll just move closer to the tea house. And just let them rest up a little bit. Looks like you're stuck with Xun Yu. Alright, we're going to move to the edge here. It would be very slow. It's okay, you guys will get along by the end. We'll give him a few sit down cavalries. Alright, that's good. So they're going west. Can we finish up finish up Coron's faction here? Ah, uh, the Confucian scholar is finally going to be dead. We did it. Good night. There we go. See, technically this contract should end, right? But I don't think we're actually on this contract. This is just a display error. Because we got paid for, you know, taking down uh, Zhang Yan over there. Which is really odd. Alright, we're going to heal up and then sell north. Oh, so the contract did end because they changed to orange. Right, which is the color of like a vassal of the enemy. Before, because we had a contract with them, we didn't have this color. I don't think it's bugged out. Like the logic of the contract are all correct. It's just that display sometime messed up. But like the, you know, how much you get paid, when you should get paid. All those things are right. All those things are correct in the game. So what we're going to do is we're going to pull her back. Because you are a wife, you might have their kids after we destroy the faction. So here's what I plan to do, right? So I'm going to summon her back. Because let's say we have Liu Chong's wife, right? Plus their kid who's in our faction. She gave birth after joining us. She was pregnant when she left. Well, the faction was destroyed. It wasn't... It wasn't a weird situation. We're going to give her kid, when he comes of age, Chen, as a vassal, right? That's the original land that was granted to Liu Chong. So we're going to respect that. And let's say if she has kids and they come of age, we're going to give them uh, Yu Zhou, which is really where he should be defending the frontier. Um, her kids, Huang Zhu's kid, will probably take like Jiang Ling. Jiang Ling or Jiang Xia. Maybe Jiang Xia, right? Huang Zhu's job under Liu Bao was to defend against Wu. So that was kind of their job. Uh, Yuan Tan will take Yuan Shao's old fact. Uh, yeah, right here. We might not want him to go north now. Now that Liu Yao has Sun Ce. We actually have a target on the map. We could take Jian Ye. Or we can just summon him here and then have him tear through the iron mines of Puya. And there's also a weapon craftsman here. Alright, I think we're going to do that instead. 
Alright, we're gonna pop him in the trade port and have him start going down. Alright, he's useless. <sighs> we gotta find that army. We can't find them. Where is he? Ah, uh, there he is. Now we can't attack him because... Uh, all right, let's just stick next to him. We can go here. All right, all right let's just hope next turn we can fight him. You know what, we're gonna go here and ambush and see if he does anything because he doesn't see us. Maybe he's just scared right now. Alright, they're gonna just have to stay here for a while. Alright, lots of things to build here. We want a state workshop, we want a private workshop. And we should probably, yeah, we'll develop first and then switch administrator over. All right, so they're just, this is just food production here. Yeah, they'll supply a lot of our food. We want the extra commerce version, so we want this version, so we need a reform. We'll wait on that. Uh, rebelling imminent everywhere. What a mess. I mean, we don't really have to care. The units will just suicide into the city. That's pretty much what will happen. Just like we saw at the temple. Alright, not, not much we can do here. I guess we just empower trade. And try to offset the stats. Yeah, we're just going to hold these guys and let them gather points. Okay. So, are we... I'm, I'm guessing we are in the contract with uh oh no we can't offer a new one right hmm that's weird i don't know why we got paid for fighting Zhang, Zhang yan's faction i know Zhang yan i don't know that's weird all right so we can still get new ones he's fighting oh guan zhi right here guan zhi yeah i'm down for that small faction someone we have to destroy anyways Get into a relationship with Hal Tal. Uh, he's not willing to pay us. That's tough. Who are you in war with? Uh, we're at war with them too. Liu Bei, Ma Teng. Uh, none of this work. Zhang Lu, maybe. Hold on, hold on. Nope. What about you guys? I mean, we could, but just not not ideal. I guess you're the only one. Yeah, take this. This is pretty bad. And then we'll want payment per turn. Tal Tal's pretty loaded here. Okay, we'll do that. Alright, new contract. Wait. Did you guys see that? Zhang Yan. Now this is a bug.
That is a bug. That is a very weird bug. But we're after them now. Um, probably have to be this army down here. They're going to be responsible for a lot of things. But we can definitely take them out and give it to the High Empire. Okay, let's just end turn. Alright, see this is... Uh, it's weird. The contracts are bugging out. Lady Tsai. Yeah, not interested. Okay, the regular army is going to go attack them. Lu Bu is going to take care of you guys. Yeah, try to fight us. Good luck. Oh, Zhou Yu is out on the field. Hmm. No one we need. We're going to have to beat that army. We want them to leave the city and then crush it. I mean, they spent they spent a lot of gold on this army. That's a lot of men. I got a level up from that. I kind of want him to lead, but I kind of want him to get this. Yeah, this is really good. All right, into the river we go. We're going to sail to this. Alright, we learned. Oh, their army's in the river. Ah, oh, can't reach them. God, they keep avoiding us. Alright, we need a... We need control of a territory to heal. Because I don't want to fight Yuan Shao here. We'll take the trade port. They're probably going to land soon. We found them. The naval delegate value is going to be a little awkward. We might lose, but can't do anything about that right now. Alright, I'm crossing the mountains here. It's a very sl slow journey, but we'll get there. Alright, they're coming out. We don't have any more forces here. All right, we're out of generals to use. That's what's happening. Maybe we'll summon Hydro. Lady Tai. Oh, reuniting the Tai clan. Yeah, that could work. Is she a spy? No, she's not. She has items too. Alright, we're reuniting the Tai clan. I'll give them Tui. Oh, we forgot if he was... Oh, he's willing to spy for us, so he can't be a spy. Double agents doesn't exist in the game. Alright, so that's okay. I'm going to switch it to... Just a cheaper version, I think. It's good enough. Oh, she has some really expensive cavalries. Okay, there we go. They'll heal up and defend for us a little bit. Um, that might be everyone. Yeah, that is everyone. Yang, Nanyang, Jiangling, Xiangyang. Oh, you know what? We could actually... It's 
play Nanyang. There we go. Private workshop. Oh, this is also going to rebel. Oh well, it's fine. Yeah. Let's end turn. Uh, cautious or careless? I mean, probably cautious. Our income is negative now because of the army that we paid over here. Super expensive army. Um, but we're going to put them to use because Matong's army is on our land and we need to get rid of them. Mm, I don't think I don't think we need to reset. We barely moved. Uh, no one has reach. That's fine. They don't have siege weapons. We can kind of wait for them here to siege, and then we can go attack them next turn. Let's start with this. Still crossing the. Can we reach this? I don't think so. Yeah, but we're going we're going anyways. Time to find out if the mercenary contract actually works. Oh, can't reach. Next turn we'll find out if actually we're supposed to be fighting them. Alright, we're gonna take this to heal. Wait, what's behind us? Ooh, two armies. Fun. Let's see if they can catch us. Mm. We're going to have to fight this and cut it out just to keep our forces totally healthy with those two armies approaching. So see you guys at the end. Alrighty. And we're going to pull our army out. And we'll see what they do. So they didn't fight us and they didn't run away. They can't reinforce each other. They're not allies, so we should be able to force them out and then chase them down. And there goes Gong Sun Zan's last army. Uh, we'll maintain momentum. I want to keep moving. Can we get out of this? Okay, that was weird. They had to move. Um, we could just march all the way into here. Perfect, perfect. Now we're pretty confident. Yeah, two army against two. Fair odds. Alright, they're spying. Uh, we see that they pulled out a new army. Oh, they're fighting. Don't kill her. Wait, are they fighting? They're, are they actually fighting or are they just walking by? Oh, they're walking by. He's just at war with us. Okay. Let's get another peek. What if we hide? Come walk over to us. Rebel hunters. Not oh, so busy. I mean, we don't need them here. The rebels can't take the city, but they get free levels, so why not? We want this one. All right, how, how goes the mountain progress? Slow. We can start marching next turn because we won't be able to heal anyways. And this turn should leave us mostly full healed. Liu solo adventure continues. Heroic victory. It's ridiculous. Like the AI agrees that we win. 
获全胜，毋庸置疑。Uh, that's actually not a bad sword. And how can she equip this? I don't think military Jen can be equipped by strategist. I could be wrong, but I don't think so. Uh, we'll execute. We'll execute. Keep moving. He doesn't get fatigued. Wait, I thought there was another army here. Disappeared. All right. Guess we'll get ready for the war against Liu Yao. Oh, Yan Bai Hu's army. That's Yan Bai Hu's wife. Where's Yan Bai Hu? That's the question. All right, they're so depleted. They're not going to be able to take the trade port. All right, what do we want to build? Um, we want to go T. All right, we're still losing money per turn, but it's okay because we're making more back from the fighting. <laughs> General who give tranquility to the north. I don't know. I don't know if we're giving tranquility or not. Yeah, we need to take care of this situation first. Alright, that might be everything. Yeah, just empower trade. Oh, more of Cao Cao's generals. Ooh, if he's a bandit, that'd be worth it. Yeah, let's do that. Uh, he's in an army. Plus two. He doesn't. He's on. Uh, he's not on the field either. I wonder if he's in this army. He's not. He's in a different army. He's in this one. He is a bandit, but he doesn't have poison volley. Okay, but we're interested in him. If he's willing to join us, we'll take him because eventually he can get poison volley. Oh, but uh, he's not in our own territory. I was thinking about we flip him, make him a revolt, summon Lu Bu here, fight her. But that's not going to be possible. Okay, we're good. Let's just continue. Alright, now they're just being annoying. They're not summoning the guys we need. And they're sending them out over there. He's outside the city. Poor guy. We're going to bounce off of him to catch them. Obviously, we have to take. We have to fight the city. So, oh, he runs. Okay, so that's gonna be more interesting. So we can attack and break siege, so that we can move. Can we not catch him? Ah, uh, that's awkward. Huh. Huh, <laughs> that's not good. I don't want to take his only city. What if we march? Alright, we're just going to go after them. Not going to worry about him. They did siege. That's dumb. That's what we thought they would do. They're going to run. And then we're going to catch them. Uh, that's why we have him. Alright. So, we can't catch them. Actually, we can. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Not uh, Pick the wrong army. I want to select the other one. Um... Hmm. 
This is the one we want. Good night. Alright, we want to execute to force Matan out. We'll get income. Alright, they can come back. Ooh, tell Marauders, but I don't think we're... Oh, he's 63. He might die. Okay, if that's the case, we get rid of everyone except for the Tell Marauder and we summon him back to court to wait till he dies of old age. Okay, I gotta fix this up. Sima Yi ah, has abandoned Tal Tal's force. Okay, the old silver fox. Let's come join us. Mm, how angry is he with us right away? He's not. He's not very angry. Okay, we're gonna remove her from her position into here. We have to set him up as a administrator so we can get him killed. Where though? They're raiding. Alright, we'll worry about Samayi's situation a bit later. Close victory with the seriously? We beat a whole army, and then this is a close victory. Maintain momentum into this army. Heroic victory. Uh, we're gonna execute to force um, try to force the anybody will come out Ooh, swarm brother oh, there goes your oh we can recruit her because she also has poison arrow all right let's keep maintaining momentum I don't need to fight him but we can fight this we can take the fishing port Maybe. Yes, we can. No? That distance, we're out of... Oh, we're exactly out of movement. Okay, that's a little lame. Because I want it... Because we're going to waste a turn on that. Okay, that's fine. Can't do anything about it now. We have Yan Bai Hu's wife. Who has really good items. No, no, no. You get nothing. And she has poison arrow. Or poison volley. So we'll definitely use her as a general. Um, I don't think we can... I, actually, let's do it. Let's disband. They're the one draining our economy. Kind of don't want to disband the infantry of Zin. They're pretty good. Uh, these guys can all go. They were just a temporary solution. Okay, they're done. Ah, time to test our contract situation. So they're on the other side of the mountain. We're going to just take this down. See if we get paid for the contract. Okay, we got paid for fame and fortune. Um, we're, 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 this is with Tall Tall. We're not going to give him land down south. Oh, and we got an item from that battle. Okay, so the contract refreshes the display, but we didn't get to pay the thousand for the mission. Our mission is still somehow on um, Zhang Yan, which is really weird. 
but we're okay with that, I guess. Okay. All right, we'll still be able to finish the contract by taking these towns, and then we're going to just trade them over to the High Empire. Okay, so I think we'll just end our episode here for now. We have a few action going on here coming up soon with Yuan Shao's forces. We'll probably destroy Gongsun Du and, uh, you know, gain control here. And we're finally going to make it out of the mountains and get into Shangyong and then battle our way to Ma Teng's base over here and get ourselves the Emperor's seat. Other than that, uh, nothing much. I think we're just going to try to find, you know, some more heads for people to kill. The only one we see right now is Sun Ren, so we're going to go for her. Probably just sell down, declare war on uh, Liu Yao, and just end it. So there's that. We'll get to that next episode. So see you guys then. Bye.